dude, if you don't want to do the work, if you're not going to do the work, just fucking tell us and go because there's people that want to fucking do the work period. I'm not here to, I'm not here to like, to, to, to be a dick. That's not what I'm trying to do. Like I, I want the best for everybody, but don't show up and don't half ass anything. Right? Like that's just not what we're here to do, which brings me to the topic of what I want to talk about today, which is winning is not enough. And I'm going to talk about that. Like as far as in your group, any asshole could dominate losers. What do I mean by that? I'm going to have some assignments I want you guys to do down the road, but think about that. Any asshole could dominate losers. In my journey, we'll even go back four years ago, before three years ago, before I had it, I started comparing myself to these people that were at the bar, driving down the bar, looking at these guys. Oh, well, I'm doing better than him because he's not drinking, right? Not saying I'm better than anybody, but justifying my own life and my actions. Oh, man, my brother-in-law, I make more money than him, but he's got to, you know what I'm saying? You start surrounding yourself. Like, we, you're not put here. None of you guys on side of this fucking phone call right now are put here to just be average. You don't come, like, you, like I've said in, in the group this weekend, you came here thinking that you had a drinking problem, but you came here to find out who the fuck you are. You came here to find out what has been holding you back, to quit hiding, to quit lying. Now I wanna really fucking like dive into the point of these people that you start comparing yourselves with. And ultimately understand that the end goal is not, it doesn't fucking matter about those people, it matters about you and what you want and who you are. But myself in my journey, like I would go through and I would look at like, oh, well, I'm making more money than my friends. So I start justifying my actions if I'm, if I don't drink or where I'm at in this, where I'm at in my process of the comeback, or I justify like looking at these average people doing average things. And then you start looking at the, the people around you and you're like, Hey man, it's okay. I can let off the gas. I can let off the gas. So the question I have for you guys internally, is: do you truly believe today you're leaving it all on the table? like at your core of who you are, even myself, like, like where I'm at four years, you know, going down this, this fucking journey. I know that I'm not, right? I know I have more to give. doesn't mean I'm in a bad place, but I want you guys to switch the mindset to fucking dominate everything. Drinking relationships, friendships, networks, being a parent, the gym. I just spoke with a doctor um, who didn't, he chose not to enroll with us right this second because he's got some issues going on, but he talked about how he used to, how he used to, how he used to fucking dominate CrossFit. And he used to do this and everyone looked up to him. He used to, and he used to, and he used to. What does that tell you? He forgot who the fuck he is. So the homework I have for today, or not, not so much the homework, but the piece, yeah, fuck it, it's homework. The piece that I want you guys to do, write this down. Is I want you to find the three closest people to you in your life. Okay, so pick them this week. Identify them. But I want you to die, like, like the three closest people to you that you actually consider winners. Then I want you to look at the other social group that you're around. We talk in the Alliance about building a dome around the people. Okay. So what I want you to do here is I want you to justify and look at the course of the people you're surrounding yourself with every single day. Now, maybe the person might be me, right? Maybe you're like, fuck, I consider Mark one of my, one of my guys or Dan or, or something like, like what I'm trying to get at is I want to correct course, correct the path for you guys to put yourself around the people that are going to fucking drive you, push you, elevate you to become the man that you want to be. So in my circle right now, and I'm going to just be straight honest with you. The people that I look up to, the people that I surround myself with, the people that I'm trying to learn from, the people that I'm going after are dominating me. Maybe not mentally right this second, but financially. And I want to keep striving to be there. So inside of your people, what I want you to do is pick the three most core people that you can, because what we're going to do is start building a network. Then I want you to look at all the people you compare yourself to. I'm going to bring some of you guys on here. At the fucking, at the parties. Oh man. Oh fucking Rick over there. Rick can't get his shit done. He's cheated on his wife, right? He's going home fucking shit face. My life is good because I'm better than Rick. Any asshole can fucking dominate an average person. Then answer this question. This is a, this is a legit one. You guys know that one of the biggest pieces about my program is creating a future that's so fucking strong that it builds a financial wall of freedom an emotional wall of freedom, a wall of freedom that's so huge around your family that nothing can break it down. 
So I want you to ask yourself, did you come here to be average? 